At Prison Professors, we are always striving to generate more resources that will help us teach and inspire people who are living in prison or people who are going through the criminal justice system, uh, people who are under government investigations. You know, do we just want to help people make better decisions so that they can recalibrate their lives and, and start living again in a meaningful, measurable way, making progress every single day to lead a life of fulfillment? And that was the reason that I traveled to New York City. Um, you can see that, that the, the beautiful skyline of New York behind me. I'm on the Upper East Side, just on the uh, uh, north end of the reservoir. And I, I like this setting because it reminds me of what we as human beings have to do when we are building something better. You can see in the distance, some of those buildings have cranes on them. And over those cranes, if you look down beneath them, if I were in that side of the, of the island, uh, I'd be able to look down and I'd see these foundations being poured and, and workers laying pipes and, and workers laying um, underground utilities and all of this stuff that takes place in order to make something great. And none of us see, we cannot see, after the buildings are built, we cannot see all of that infrastructure that gets built. Well, similarly, we all have to invest in ourselves and we're effectively building an infrastructure. Well, our team at Prison Professors is super enthusiastic uh, about this, uh, these opportunities that we have to share videos and, and educational content to teach and inspire people who are living in prison. But one of the things that we have to do is pr produce more professional grade videos. So right now I'm filming this on an iPhone. I've just got a really simple little, what's called a selfie stick that I'm holding the iPhone and I'm just talking directly into the, into the, uh, the telephone, um, the, the cellular phone, the smartphone, um, just trying to record content that I can teach to people that I can use to record a video that I will send inside of jails and prisons, but it's not going to be enough. You see, in addition to filming the videos, we also have to invest in some infrastructure, just like the builders of those skyscrapers behind us. We have to do some editing to this video and we are going to have to insert captions at the bottom of every video and we're going to have to uh, title them and then publish them. And all of that takes, of course, an extraordinary amount of time. Well, fortunately, while I was here in New York City, we, we generated some resources from businesses that, are that have agreed to help sponsor us. And we are going to use some of those sponsorship funds to provide a job for a formerly incarcerated individual who's going to help me with the editing. So the new process that will take place after I get back to California will be I will record the videos and the interviews that I do with various people, but then I will take the uh, raw footage and load it into a cloud. Now, the cloud is something I wouldn't have understood what it was while I was in prison, but really what it, it's, it's like, you know, you're, when you're listening to the radio and the radio just comes through the box, all of that digital file, that digital media is stored on some external device and it gets boomed out to your radio. Um, similarly, I can take the footage that I record and load it into a digital repository, a cloud-based system that anybody can access as long as they have the password and the URL. So my friend, Casper, who did time in prison, but he trained himself in the digital arts. And so he is now skilled as a photographer, a videographer, and also a video editor. So he will be able to access the raw footage that I record and he will be able to mix that raw footage so that it is, um, so that it is uh, accessible to people um, in a manner that, that, they can, that is easier for them to consume. And we have to record this in multiple different formats. So of course we publish on YouTube. And if you're watching this program on YouTube, I do hope that you will subscribe to Prison Professor so that you can see the efforts that we make every day to uh, create content to teach and inspire people in prison. But I also, um, besides subscribing on YouTube, we make the courses available uh, through these different formats by sending them into jails and prisons. And, and those are jails and prisons that include right now, every state prison in California, um, New York City Department of Corrections, um, bah, 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 where else? Washington State Department of Corrections, um, um, countless county jails, and other facilities, Michigan uh, uh, Department of Corrections, through various tablets that that we we provide our content on. So so people in jails and prisons all across the country get access to this information. And you know what it does for them? It gives them hope. 
it helps them believe if I can show them I was in prison for 26 years and I can come to communities like New York and uh, meet with business executives and explain to them why mass incarceration is really one of the great social injustices of our time and then persuade uh, those executives to uh, provide capital, provide resources that we can use to fund the development of this content. So I, I've been funding it pretty much by myself for many years, but we've just launched a nonprofit. And because of that nonprofit, I'm going to be able to solicit donations from different businesses. And those donations will be tax deductible to the businesses, but they will be resources that we can use to uh, provide jobs for formerly incarcerated people. Um, and and, and there's, a real, there's a lot of good that comes from that because formerly incarcerated people, while they're waiting in a halfway house or or they're, they're on home confinement and they're looking for work, this is an opportunity for them to be able to do some work that will later uh, not only help them build their resume, but will also translate well into developing skills that they can use to launch their own ventures. You know, in this era of a pandemic, many of us have to figure out ways to create our own income streams because traditional uh, pathways to employment are cut off from us. So, so, so we've got to think in innovative ways. And that's really the basis for all of the content and the courses that we create at Prison Professors is we want people to learn how to be the CEO of their own life. We want them to figure out how are they going to get their own leads. We want them to figure out how are they going to close their own sales. How are they going to deliver the products and uh, the, 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 the tools or, or the services that they promise to deliver to consumers? And want to teach them how to document it. So everything that we do at Prison Professors, we're, we're really doing it in a transparent way. In fact, I'm super enthusiastic about getting home back to California. I fly home tomorrow because it should be ready to launch our new website at Prison Professors, which, include, which is going to include this new uh, uh, tool called a, a CRM system which is a customer relationship management program. So what that effectively means is we will be able to document when somebody comes into our funnel, right? Somebody visits prison professors for the first time, um, they can provide their email, they could ask a question. Um, once they do that, we could provide those people with um, uh, content that they're looking for, hopefully to help solve their problem. Um, in addition to working to solve their problem though, we will create a record of everything that we are doing. So a, if somebody hires us for something or other, um, they will get a scope of work and that scope of work will define the service that we are going to provide. And once we provide the service, the client will sign off on it to uh, confirm that they have received uh, the, the bill of goods or the services that we promised to deliver. Um, that, of course, uh, that, that commitment to transparency is, is, is something that's very helpful to us in that we know what we are supposed to deliver and the consumer knows what he is paying to receive. Um, also, the documentation really helps us with accounting. And I can run all of that business just with my cell phone and an internet connection and my laptop computer, so I can be anywhere in the world doing that. That's what I wanna teach other people how to do. But even if you're in prison, even if you're in jail, and you don't have access to these tools right now, what you do have access to are these videos that I am creating. So you're getting to see the end result. And by looking at the end result, you, are, you should have uh, irrefutable proof showing that it is possible to lead a life of meaning and fulfillment and relevance, even if you've made some bad decisions that put you in the crosshairs of a government investigation, making you perhaps starting off as a witness to a government investigation and then escalating to becoming a subject of a government investigation and then escalating further to becoming the target of a government investigation or perhaps a, uh, a defendant in a criminal case and eventually sitting inside of a jail or a prison or in America. We want to help people make better decisions at every stage in the journey. That's what Prison Professors is about. I mean, when you think about a university system, right? You go into a university system, you take various classes, and you learn how to prepare for your chosen vocation or your chosen career or your chosen profession, but you do it in incremental stages. Well, that's what we offer here at Prison Professors. We offer uh, a series of information that's self-directed that you can learn from on your own if you have to hire a defense attorney, if you have to hire a civil attorney, if you have to uh, work to uh, train your workforce and you wanna figure out 
uh, pathways to make sure that you can avoid a government investigation. We try to provide as much digital content as we possibly can. It's all free on our YouTube channel. Um, and of course, we also offer books and courses that we make available for purchase at a moderate price. And, and then of course we offer consulting services as well. So, you know, we're really striving to build almost a, a university-like experience where you can get the type of content that you want to find. And we're going to employ, the only people that we employ will be people who are formerly incarcerated or have some connection to the criminal justice system. That's one of the ways that we can show people how to be the change that we all want to see in the world. It is the strategy that I used to prepare for success was by learning from leaders. Uh, I did that while I was going through 26 years in prison and it made all the difference in the world with regard to helping me build income opportunities, helping me to uh, build a life of meaning and relevance and not be saddled and, and, and crippled because of the bad decisions that I made during the recklessness of youth that put me inside of the prison system. So if you haven't subscribed to Prison Professors yet, please do so and uh, please share it with your friends. This is one of the ways that, that we can be the change that we want to see in the world. Um, if you've got a loved one in prison, you might want to visit us at prisonprofessors.com. Take a look at our books and courses and uh, see if those, uh, if those books and courses can be a value to your loved one. Um, if you are facing a government investigation, of course, or, or you've been charged with a crime, we really encourage you to, to, to do as much due diligence as you possibly can. Research everything because the decisions you make every single day have an enormous influence or impact on, on, on the options that are available. I didn't understand those options when I was a young man. And as a result, I suffered significantly uh, harsher sanctions than I should have. And, and so I'm learning every day and hoping to share what I learn with as many people as possible. So please subscribe to the Prison Professors Program. Share it with as many people as possible. And, uh, and again, visit us at prisonprofessors.com. Thank you. I am Michael Santos and appreciate the support that you've shown even by watching this video. Thank you.